the best road trips in Canada you need to take. As the world's second largest country with the world's most extensive coastline Canada is made for road tripping. It's easy to head off the beaten path in this largely uninhabited country, which is what road trips are all about. From west to east, here are the best, and most scenic, road trips you need to enjoy in the Great White North Cabot Trail The Cabot Trail is undoubtedly one of the most famous road trips in Canada. There are many things to love about this 300km, 186-mile, highway on Cape Breton Island in Nova Scotia. Fiercely, it hugs the coastline, therefore, you can expect breathtaking sea views at every turn. Secondly, there are some incredible hikes on the island, including the Skyline Trail. Finally, the Cabot Trail is known for its artisans, tourism Nova Scotia even places a spotlight on them in their artisan road trip itinerary. With its blend of Celtic and Acadian hospitality, this road trip destination is an amazing one. Best time to go, summer for consistently good weather, but October to see the fall foliage. Icefields Parkway The Icefields Parkway stretches for 232 kilometers, 144 miles, through the Canadian Rockies, connecting the towns of Jasper and Banff. People often describe it as one of the world's most scenic highways, and you can expect to pull over frequently to see 100 ancient glaciers, waterfalls cascading from dramatic rock spires and turquoise lakes set in sweeping valleys. Travel Alberta recommends stops such as Lake Louise, Crowfoot Glacier, Bow, and Pado Lakes, Columbia Icefield, and Sinwata and Athabasca Falls. Best time to go, June to September. Sea to Sky Highway The Sea to Sky Highway links Vancouver to Whistler they are less than two hours apart. However, it offers those beautiful west coast views that characterize this region in British Columbia. Popular places to stop include Whitecliff Park in West Vancouver, Shannon Falls, BC's third largest waterfall, and Brittany Mine Museum, which is great for kids. The Sea to Sky Gondola is definitely a must visit too, with its scenic views and suspension bridge. Then you can head to Squamish before reaching Whistler. Best time to go. July to September is Vancouver's dry season. Road trip around the Okanagan Valley. This road trip may not be a traditional one going from point A to point B but the Okanagan Valley is a gastronomic hot spot. Circle clockwise around Okanagan Lake from Vernon to Penticton and then toward Galona. The region is known for its farm-to-table restaurants and award-winning wineries. Rowdeasy Regional Table is Kelowna's best restaurant, or so their website states, while Davison Orchards is a great place for families favorite wineries include Summerhill Pyramid Winery and Mission Hill Winery. Best time to go, July to September for warm temperatures. Vancouver Island Vancouver Island is undoubtedly one of Canada's most beautiful islands, as its landscape includes rainforests, mountains, and rugged coastlines. Two popular places to visit are Victoria and Tofino, which are quite a distance apart. On the way, stop at Cowichan Valley which is known for its orchards and wineries, and then a cathedral grove for a forest photo op. In Tofino, enjoy world-famous surfing at Chesterman Beach, and sunsets from Long Beach. Vancouver Island is also known for its unique hotels, which will complement any road trip. Best time to go, March to May and September to November. Dempster Highway as Canada's only all-weather road across the Arctic Circle. Travel Yukon calls the Dempster Highway from Dawson to Inuvik in the Northwest Territories one of the world's unique driving routes. It's extremely isolated, with only one accommodation option along the way in Eagle Plains, but the landscape is unrivaled. Cross the Arctic Circle and visit Tombstone Park, and then take two river ferries into the Northwest Territories. Time your arrival in Inuvik with the Great Northern Arts Festival, held annually in mid-July. Best time to go. Summer is the only time to go. Trans-Canada Highway The Trans-Canada Highway is the most epic road trip you can take in Canada. It stretches across the country through all ten provinces. Starting in Victoria, it ends in St. John's in Newfoundland and Labrador. Some of the, many, highlights awaiting road trippers include Vancouver and its many attractions, Lake Louise and Banff National Park in the Canadian Rockies, the Alberta Badlands, the capital in Ottawa, Quebec City, Fundy National Park, and Gros Mornay National Park. Best time to go, March to October for optimal weather coast to coast. 